Have you ever lain awake at night, haunted by the ghosts of choices unmade, the what-ifs and could-have-beens that whisper through the corridors of our minds, leaving us questioning the paths we didn't take? Matt Haig in his contemporary fiction from 2020, The Midnight Library invites us on a profound journey of self-discovery, exploring the intricate tapestry of choices, regrets, and the very essence of what it means to live a fulfilling life. Hello, and welcome back to the Book Box Summaries, bringing literature to life one summary at a time. So grab a kappa, get comfy, and join us on this incredible journey through the world of literature. Through the eyes of Nora Seed, a young woman grappling with the weight of her perceived failures, we're invited to confront our own relationship with regret and the liberating power of embracing the present moment. The Midnight Library is not your typical library. It's a place between life and death, a mystical repository of infinite possibilities. Within its hallowed halls, each book represents a different life Nora could have lived, each page a diverging path based on a single decision. Imagine holding the book of your life, its spine creaking with the weight of unfulfilled dreams and unrealized potential. This is the captivating premise that sets the stage for Nora's extraordinary adventure, a journey that transcends the boundaries of reality and delves into the deepest recesses of the human heart. Nora Seed is a woman drowning in a sea of regret. Haunted by the belief that she's failed in every aspect of her life, she finds herself at a crossroads, contemplating whether life is even worth living. On one hand, she's plagued by the thought of disappointing her loved ones, the missed opportunities and the dreams left unrealized. On the other hand, there's a flicker of hope, a faint whisper urging her to explore the what-ifs that haunt her. Nora's journey is an emotional roller coaster, a testament to the resilience of the human spirit as she navigates the treacherous waters of self-doubt and emerges stronger, transformed by the wisdom gleaned from her extraordinary experiences. As Nora delves deeper into the library's infinite shelves, she encounters a myriad of alternate lives. Each book offers a glimpse into a world where she made different choices, from pursuing her passion for swimming to marrying her former fiancé. With each life she steps into, she experiences the consequences of those choices, both the exhilarating highs and the heartbreaking lows. One life finds her living the glamorous life of a rock star, while another paints a picture of domestic bliss as a wife and mother. Yet each life comes with its own set of challenges, reminding us that there's no such thing as a perfect path. One of the most poignant themes explored in the Midnight Library is the pervasive nature of regret. Nora, like many of us, carries the heavy burden of past mistakes, the what-ifs that cast long shadows over her present reality. Never underestimate the big importance of small things, Haig writes, reminding us that even seemingly insignificant decisions can have a ripple effect, shaping the course of our lives. Through Nora's experiences, we're forced to confront our own relationship with regret, to acknowledge the pain it inflicts while recognizing its potential as a catalyst for growth and self-awareness. As Nora journeys through the labyrinthine corridors of the library, she begins to gain a fresh perspective on her life. She realizes that happiness isn't a destination, but a journey, a collection of moments, both big and small, that weave together the intricate tapestry of our existence. The only way to learn is to live, Haig reminds us, urging us to embrace the present moment with open arms, to find joy in the everyday experiences that often go unnoticed. Through Nora's transformative journey, we're reminded that true fulfillment lies not in chasing an elusive ideal, but in appreciating the beauty and complexity of the lives we're living. The Midnight Library, with its infinite shelves and endless possibilities, serves as a powerful metaphor for the choices we make in life. Each book represents a different path, a different version of ourselves, and the sheer magnitude of possibilities can be overwhelming. Yet, as Nora discovers, the true journey lies not in endlessly searching for the perfect life, but in learning to navigate the uncertainty with courage and an open heart. It's about embracing the unknown, accepting that there will be missteps along the way, and trusting that each experience, both positive and negative, contributes to our growth and evolution.
Through her extraordinary experiences, Nora learns the importance of letting go of the past and embracing the present moment. She realizes that true happiness lies not in dwelling on what could have been, but in appreciating the beauty of the life unfolding before her. It's not what you look at that matters, it's what you see, Haig writes, reminding us that our perception shapes our reality. By shifting our focus from regret and longing to gratitude and appreciation, we open ourselves up to a world of possibilities, finding joy in the simplest of things and discovering the extraordinary within the ordinary. The Midnight Library is a must-read for anyone who's ever questioned the path they've chosen, who's grappled with regret, or who's simply curious about the infinite possibilities that life holds. It's a story that will stay with you long after you've turned the final page, prompting you to reflect on your own life choices and to embrace the present moment with renewed appreciation. If you're looking for a thought-provoking, emotionally resonant read that will challenge your perceptions and leave you feeling inspired, The Midnight Library is a journey you won't want to miss. Before we go, we ask for your help. Please subscribe to our channel. With your subscription, you are encouraged us to create more summaries, comments, and recommendations are welcome. Hit the like button, share with friends, and turn on notifications to stay in the loop. See you next time.